We are going to learn about rocks and minerals today. So raise your hand if you have seen a rock before. Our mission is to educate students and teachers about Alaska's natural resources. So it is our goal to teach the teachers about what the resources are in the state, how we get them, what we use them for, and the careers associated with them. No one's picked my favorite rock yet. I'm excited. And then they can take that information and share it with their students. But we also go directly into the classroom and try to really ignite an interest in students starting in kindergarten and keeping that alive all the way through high school. Guys, you know what we use fluorite for? It's in our toothpaste to keep our teeth safe. Well, it's really good to have support outside of the classroom, so to have something that connects our classroom to our state as a whole, and just for them to be able to have a specific takeaway. Pick quick so everybody gets an opportunity. I'm sitting back watching and thinking, we really are connected to a vast expanse, literally, of this wilderness that has so many untapped minerals and resources that I, as a teacher, am excited to learn about more so I can teach them in the smallest ways and then as they progress on to, to just learn more about those. We'll come around, we'll put some supplies on your guys' tables and then you guys can begin to make your pet rocks, all right? Our economy is based off of resources. Everything in our daily lives comes from resources. And it's important for students to know and understand where those things are coming from. Disagreement, what do you think? Rock or mineral? Mineral. Yeah, it's a mineral. And why they're important. And then now, even more than ever, what the careers are associated with that to try to keep kids here in Alaska. When I grow up, I'm going to be a scientist in Alaska. When I grow up, I want to study the Alaska's rocks and minerals. I feel excitement when we leave the classroom because you see kids really lighting up. See the difference? One type of mineral, lots of different types of minerals. See all the little specks and flecks in there? And getting excited, you put rocks and minerals in their hands and they, they get excited. They understand where things are coming from. They start to look at the world around them with a different lens. 